One of the design features which Bermad's incorporated into the entire range of the ear valves is they've actually um, threaded a quarter or one eighth BSP thread into the valve body itself. Now what this means to you as an irrigation grower, designer or operator is when you are designing an irrigation system, you want to know what the pressure is at a variety of different locations throughout the paddock. And the idea of having a, a plug in the valve is a multi-purpose function. One of the things that we know is that the most accurate location to actually read the pressure in any irrigation system is in a static condition. So when you have water flow in a pipeline and you have an air valve on top of the pipeline, the water is stationary in the pipeline. So being able to include a pressure gauge into the side of an air valve is the best location to actually enable you to determine what the pressure is on your irrigation scheme. Now the options which we've given you here is that the valve has an optional plug which can be easily removed and a pressure gauge can be fitted full time. In some instances, uh, some particular users prefer not to have a fixed pressure gauge, but they prefer to have either a pressure checkpoint or a Schrader valve. So the Schrader valve gives you the ability to come along with your pressure gauge, simply install the pressure gauge into the actual Schrader valve and that can read the pressure. So the key advantage of having this small quarter inch plug in here is to make the valve multi-purpose. It gives you the ability to understand what you're doing in your irrigation system when you're operating it. Now, in other instances, if you're at a, a, a valve hurdle, in other words, you're in the paddock in a vineyard or an olive grove, and you've got a check filter and a control valve controlling water into the paddock, in some cases, they'll even remove the plug and use a remote sense location. So this is used to enable a pressure reducing valve to sense the pressure in the most accurate location that it can be. In some instances, uh, if you're uh, running a drip irrigation system, when you are designing a drip irrigation system, one of the most accurate locations when you're registering pressure to get the right uh, dripper emission rate is at the very end of the drip irrigation line. And in many cases, our valves are located at the very end of the drip irrigation system, and this is where they actually register the pressure. So the idea of the, the thread is a multi-purpose function to, to make it adaptable to many irrigation purposes. Mm -hmm.